March 2020. The Cydonia Institute, a group of researchers that investigate strange formations on the surface of Mars, publishes a study analyzing satellite photographs taken of the planet. The images show what the researchers claim look like four and five-sided pyramids and a series of curious mounds. The whole idea for the Sedoni Institute started when NASA announced in 1991 that they were going to return to Mars with the Mars Observer. And over the last 30-some years of our group studying NASA photographs, we have found an enormous amount of evidence that led us to believe there are artificial structures on Mars. What we're trying to do is get a preponderance of evidence together so that we can prove the point that there's ruins all over the planet. And just as you would here on Earth, you're gonna look for straight lines, parallel lines, circles, squares, rectangles, things of this nature. And when you find them, then you can start to zoom in on areas and look for even uh, stronger details. When the Perseverance landed, one of the first things that I noticed was a conical pyramid in the distance. The camera there took a beautiful couple pictures of it. It doesn't make any sense to me geologically how that could happen. That was one of the biggest anomalies that was seen. We're still going to get better and better pictures. We're going to have more to look at as NASA releases all of these images from Perseverance, but we haven't gotten there yet because the Perseverance, they landed in the middle of Big Lake. And I think the only thing we're gonna find there is probably shells, things from a aquatic environment. I think all of the ruins that people are looking for, they're gonna be found once they drive a little further in a perimeter. Cities in ruins on the surface of Mars? Could the remnants of an ancient Martian civilization have really been hiding in plain sight? It's a question that researchers have pondered for more than four decades, ever since NASA sent the first satellites into orbit around the red planet. Mars has piqued the curiosity of scientists and the public for millennia, but it really wasn't until the dawn of the space age that we started getting an idea of what the planet was really all about. Mariner 4 in 1965 flies past the planet, sends back 22 fuzzy photographs, and Mars looks just like the moon. Then we sent two spacecraft, Viking 1 and Viking 2, in 1976. So we got tens of thousands of photographs from orbit. Since then, as we get better resolution photographs from the surface of Mars, people have thought they saw all kinds of things there. There is a not insignificant group of people that think that we've already discovered life on Mars, that there are structures there, that there are buildings, obelisks, some kind of indicator of ancient cultures that is being covered up. You look at images of this and people are spotting all sorts of strange shapes and pyramids structures of some kind on the Martian surface. Is it something left by a lost civilization as maybe a, a monument to themselves and their achievement? For some, the most compelling evidence that an ancient civilization once existed on Mars can be found in a photograph, which shows what appears to be a large structure that has come to be known as the face on Mars. In Viking lander photographs, it was discovered that there was this weird looking structure that looks for all the world in the Viking photos like a face. Everything is proportional. The face is a mile and a half, two miles long. The eyes a quarter mile, the nose about a half a mile. So it's not small structure, it's very large structure. I believe that the face on Mars was created from uh, possibly an existing mesa. It's not just a face, but on top of that, people saw what they called the DNM pyramid, which is this weird five-sided structure that looks like a five-sided pyramid. People were claiming this had to be artificial structures. The DNM pyramid is a five-sided structure. The five faces have all this very symmetrical geometry of 30 degrees, 60 degrees, and 90 degrees. 
It's just a remarkable out of place artifact on the surface of Mars. What researchers looking at this found is that because of its exquisite geometry, there's no way that this could be created naturally. Decades after the famous photograph was taken, the face on Mars continues to inspire both fascination and debate. Many researchers believe it and other curious formations on the red planet merit further study and discussion. Some of this may just be a trick of the light, funny shaped rocks, that sort of thing. But only one of these things has got to be the real deal. And we're in game changing territory. Was there once an advanced civilization on Mars? Some of the features on the planet's surface definitely make you wonder.